And it's time for trash talking. Talking a little trash. So anyway, I've got my helping hand here. Let's see if my helping hand actually behaves this week or if it gets a little handsy. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to see you guys. It means so much to me that you guys are able to take a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. It means so much to me. I appreciate you guys more than you know. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. If you're new to my channel, I hope you would take a quick second. Hit that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join us for future videos. Today we are going to be doing a little Wednesday style trash talking. Talking a little trash. So anyway, I'm going to try to keep this short. I'm losing my voice here and there. My bangs are a hot mess today. They don't want to stay in place. So you know what? We're just going to go for it. Have a little fun. And I'll try to keep an eye on the time. So anyway, first thing I've got right here in my empties is at the Scentsy. This is a fabric spray. This one is called Clothesline. It just really, really smells like fresh linen out on the line. This you would use like for breeze. You can spray it like on curtains, maybe uh, bedspreads, comforters that you don't wash all the time, but you want to have a, have them a little fresh. Maybe clothes in your closet like sweaters that you didn't wear all season and now you want to pull them out or summer clothes. You just kind of spray them on, spray them on carpets. You can spray this on couches, on curtains. So it's just really, really nice. It's a really nice fragrance clothesline. Love that one. This one is Arctic Kiss. It's a Scentsy Wax Melt. This is uh, one that I would have done uh, during the winter time. So anyway, this one's just a nice, clean, fresh smelling winter fragrance. Arctic Air, you just kind of go out, you breathe in. You know the kind where it's so cold outside that your nostrils kind of go together? Yeah, it's that kind of, that kind of scent. Just really, really nice. I know that's not a good way to describe it, but that's what winters here like sometimes. This one, another Scentsy Wax Bar. This one was Jimmy Time. This is absolutely one of my favorites. It's like lavender and freezer, and it's just so clean and relaxing. Just love that scent. I love it in the bedrooms, but I love it all around the house, especially like if I've got a cold and I always have a cold. This one was another one for Christmas time. It was like the orange clove pomodoro or something. This one has that scent that just kind of reminds me of things that we used to do in brownies and Sunday school around Christmas time where we'd get an orange and we'd peel it, we'd put some lace around it, tie it with a bow, and then stick all kinds of cloves in there and come home and put it on our Christmas tree. Love that scent. That's what that reminds me of. And I think this is the last scent seed that I put in here. Cozy chai. I love this scent. This is, again, one of my favorites. I love the smell of chai with the cinnamon and mocha and just all those vanilla things in here. I hate the taste of chai. Love the scent. Love this one. We've got some face mask right here and some eye mask. So we've got this eye mask right here and all these face masks probably would have been from a blend of Ipsy, uh, Face Story, probably Amazon, probably some friend mail. Just, I love, I love using sheet masks. This one, oh my gosh, is one of my favorites. So much serum and it's kind of nice, soft rose scent. I know a lot of people don't like that, but I like that. So anyway, just some fun ones as well. Love using sheet masks. I've been using some more of my other masks that I've gotten tubes, uh, some clay masks and things like that, just so I can use them up before they go back me. This one was when Scentsy was first getting into selling some of the Fenty products and they had a box of Fenty. This one is what they called like fat serum or fat toner something like that but it's a uh, use for toner but it was thick like a serum so I did enjoy using this it took me a while to use it I was using pretty much it all the time until I got that PR box from Stalvana and I was I said that I would use those products exclusively until they were gone and so I used that toner that they gave me that lasted forever love that toner love this one too I still don't know if I was supposed to use a serum with it because like I said it was thick but I did use it um, I would definitely get this again. I did love this using this Fenty fat toner. Alrighty, so this was um, probably from Glossy Box. 
and this was re night cream so nourish nourishing night cream a nice moisturizer to use at night a nice heavy moisturizer got a few uses out of it i did enjoy using that and i am a secret girl so finally got my secret this um it's like a setting spray and i honestly don't know if it would have come from ipsy or glossy box but it had such a nice fragrance. It says a matte finish. Um, you can use it to prep and then you can use it to prime as well. You can also use it as a finishing spray for your face and body. I just love the scent of it. It was a nice light fragrance. It was a nice fine mist. I've got some other mists that come out like a squirt and they just kind of go all over the place. So yeah, I don't use those anymore. But this just had a nice fine mist, a nice soft fragrance. I did enjoy using that. Um, from IT Cosmetics. This is a color correcting. It is a full, full coverage cream. I do like the coverage on this. What I like the most about it is it's got that SPF of 50. Absolutely love using that product. Focus, please. I'm going to take a quick break. Like I said, I've got some trouble with um, cold and catching my breath. So I'm going to take a quick break and I will, I will be back. Alrighty, just had to have a quick break. Like I said, I've got a cold again, and it's just kind of affecting um, my breathing, things like that. So anyway, let's try to see if we can finish it this time. So I got this perfume. I honestly don't remember if I got this in an Ipsy. It's got these crystals, these quartz crystals at the bottom. It was a really, really nice fragrance. I it still. Oh, it still smells really nice. If I saw this again, I would definitely buy it. Um, yeah, I'm not even sure if to find me is the name, but anyway, it was really, really nice. Nice fragrance. Loved it. Scentsy. I love, love their sugar scrubs. They are so, they're so moist, but they've got so much sugar and conditioners and things in here. They just really feel great. This one was Luna. Again, one of my, this is like all white kind of flowers, right? Fragrances and just really love this. So moisturizing, great products for your skin. And uh, yeah, I definitely would get some more of that. This I more than likely got an Ipsy. It was Farm X. And it's a Bakukiel serum. And this is supposed to be focus, please. Like if you've got um, trouble with retinol, if it's too strong for your skin, this is supposed to be an alternative. I don't know if I've got any problems with retinol or anything like that. But I did get this and used it. So I would definitely enjoy getting that again in a future box. This, again, I don't know if it was Ipsy or Glossy Box, but it was a vitamin C. Vitamin C. So it was 20% serum. With this, I wasn't sure if I was using it right, but when I would go to the step with my moisturizer, I would just use like one or two drops in there rub the moisturizer like this with this and then put it on my face didn't have any issues with redness or burning or anything like that so it's just a really nice vitamin c product this one uh probably again would have been from glossy box this was one kind it's a it says dream cream nighttime moisturizer with squalene and rose chip oil really enjoyed using that i would just put it on before going to bed and it just was a nice last minute moisturizer and yeah i got a few uses out of that this i don't remember when could have been six months ago could have been even longer than that ago but elf was having a sale and i wanted to try some of their products i'd got like some um eyeshadows and things like that from them but i wanted to try some of their cleansers and things like that so i got this cleanser and it was called holy hydration daily cleanser with hyaluronic acid and ceramides it was nice enough to me um focus please it just kind of left um <coughs> left a kind of heavy kind of film on my skin I just didn't feel clean after using it so I would use it as my first wash and then I would go in and do a second wash but I would probably more than likely not buy it again just because I don't want to have to do a second cleanse if I don't want to especially where I only wear makeup on days that I film or the days I go to the office which is maybe every once or twice a month um, so I'm just kind of washing off uh, the serum the moisturizers things like that that I put on during the day and of course if I had coffee and spilled coffee all over the place and ready so this was a really nice serum it would have been when I had boxy charms so we're probably talking 
one to two years ago, but this is Epion. It was a flawless serum. I think when they have this, they show it the retail value of this. It's like up between 110 and 120. They had like a buy one, get one free, but you didn't pay the full price. I probably would have paid $30 and got two of these. And so I did give one in a giveaway. I finally got around to using it. Loved it. It's a really nice lightweight serum. And, um, they just had some kind of a sale like that again on Ipsy, so I did order another one. It wasn't a buy one, get one type deal, but it was a nice price. I did enjoy using that because it was such a nice, lightweight serum. I'm almost done because I need another break. So anyway, this uh, was base, Basic Beauty. It was an eye primer, eyeshadow primer. I more than likely got this in Ipsy, and I probably did not open it until it was past the expiration. I didn't even look to see what the date was it was hard as a rock in here i tried like cutting the tip way way down to get things out and when it did i finally got some out it was just yeah so i said now i'm not putting that on my eyes so anyway if i got it again i would use it right away or at least check the date all right so then i got this lipstick more than likely it would have been an ipsy i don't think the, it's probably going to focus pink lemonade i think it says but anyway it was a really really focus please nice shade for me it was a nice nude color as you can see i got just about everything out of there i can still get more out of there if i wanted to i've got this um lip brush uh lipstick brush i guess you call them from when i was doing like mary Kay, 30 40 40 years ago yeah, 40 years ago. And uh, so, yeah, I still have some of those brushes that we used to use because we used to get those cute little palettes with the uh, the lips and things like that. So you just kind of roll it up and it's good to use like liner and things like that on your, per on your lipstick. So, yeah, I use that to get as much out of this as I can. I just love those nude shades on me. The last two items were both from Ipsy. One probably would have been in the Ipsy Glam Bag, the little one, and then one would have been an add-on. And I love getting these Tasha products from them. So this one was the Dewy Skin Cream. I'm pretty sure this is like the moisturizer for dry skin. It's a purple riso. Love the Tasha products. So this one, focus please. I probably would have got in my Ipsy uh, glam bag. And then this one would have been the add-on. And again, this one is Tasha. And this is the overnight repair. And that was really good. I enjoyed using that. I always try to get them in the add-ons when I can. So anyway, I'm going to try to go take another break. So I want to thank you guys so much for stopping in and spending some time with me. It really means a lot to me. I hope you guys go out. Have a great week. Take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Have some fun. I love you guys so much, and we will see you in our next video.